Hello everyone, it's Tom with the SS Motion here today, today with another Call of Duty Mega Bloks review. And today we're taking a look at the Call of Duty Collector Construction Set Sam Turret, set number 06867. It's for ages 10 and up, and it includes 91 pieces. So before we take a look at the build, we're going to first take a look at the figure. And as you can see, it's your standard soldier included in this set. He includes a green rucksack, a green ammo pouch and leg strap, another green pouch here, and a grey concussion grenade, the M4 styled weapon, and what I like to class as the recon style head with the headset and goggles. He's very cool and his trousers actually match the different style camouflage included in the tank. So that's pretty cool. And this is actually a really nice figure who I think will make a lot of... A lot of good army builders, I'd say. Like, you could buy a lot of this set and you would be able to mix things up and have quite a cool army display, I guess. Um, so the other part included is the small Sam turret as seen here. We get a couple of sandbags on the base plate, a piece of foliage and then to show you this on camera it is adjustable, you can turn it, the legs are individually adjustable and there's a red light in the middle here which is very cool and we will show you one thing quickly if we just angle it back so the only problem with this is the joint shoes are quite small so it's quite hard to get a decent pose out of it but I mean if you work with it for long enough you can get a good enough pose um, and there's not really much else to say really because it's quite a small set except for the fact that there is one cool thing we try and get this out let's try another one and that is uh, the removable rockets are actually the RPG tips from the APC and the I'm certain there's another set the RPG's included in, but I can't remember it off the top of my head. Um, I know we definitely see it in the APC, and it appears in the Claw as well, that is the other set. Um, this set, I would actually say is intended to be used with the Claw, because it has quite a similar backdrop on the box to the Claw set. It has a figure in similar styled camouflage to the Claw set. And it just generally feels as if that might be what it was intended to be used with. And that said, not a very long review for you guys today because this is one of the smaller £10 sets of the line. It is, however, a very nice set. The Sam is constructed nicely and is very accurate to its appearance in, I believe, Modern Warfare 3. Although this set, I don't know, something just says to me, the red lighter says it's automatic, says that it's maybe meant to be a Black Ops 2 set. Although I wouldn't be entirely sure. Um, the Sam, however, it is nice. The figure's nice. You get some sandbags, which is always good. And a piece of foliage. So, for £10, it's a good set. I would recommend it. Um, I know this has been a quick review, but there's not really much to say with this set. It's nice to look at. It's a good display piece. Would I recommend it? If you see it, go out and buy it. Okay, so, that said, with the Call of Duty reviews, I'm looking to buy some other bits and bobs in the near future. But for now, there should be two more reviews that have come out before you see this. I believe the Juggernaut and the Chopper. Not Chopper, sorry, the motorbike, but I call it a Chopper because it looks a bit like the Chopper-style motorbike. And then after this review, one to two weeks' time, depending on things, I should hopefully have the Ghost's helicopter to review for you guys. Okay, guys, this has been another Call of Duty review with me, Tom, from the SS Motion. Please remember to like, favourite and subscribe. And until the next time we do a review, have a great week guys.